welcome back to my channel. So I'm finally doing my Dollar Tree haul. Um, it's kind of big. It was two, three, I think three stores. I'm not sure. Um, found a lot of new stuff and a lot of wishlist items, but we're going to get into the boring stuff. There's actually not that much food. Surprisingly, I usually, I'm always having to get my food stuff there, but we just have everything. So the only things that we needed were um, some more pizza crust. I do have to get pepperoni, but for me, it's not worth it to buy it at Dollar Tree because if you've seen my Instagram, I load my pizza up with pepperoni, like a ton. So for me, it's cheaper to get the pepperoni at the grocery store. Um, and I usually buy the cheese at the grocery store too. So the only thing I get from there is the crusts, the sauce, and then sometimes olives. So I got two more pizza crusts. And then I tried one of these and they're actually really good. So, and my husband said he likes them to take to lunch, uh, in his lunch box and he snacks on it during the day. Um, it's the Cocoa Puffs cereal bar. You get three. So I picked up two. And then Shannon wanted these original gummy fun mix gummy party so you get gummy bears gummy sharks gummy worms gummy cherries and gummy swirls so you get all of those kinds so she got that and then Leland wanted the black forest gummy bears and this is a 7.5 ounce bag this is a lot heavier than that one yeah, that one's only four ounce, a four ounce bag. So you get cherry, lemon, pineapple, orange, apple, and strawberry. So he got a bag of those. That's it for food, but like food related. I use these for DIYs, not for pizza, even though they do work for pizza. Um, I have a really nice one that we got from our, for our wedding as a wedding gift. Um, it's a lot sturdier than these but I mean these do work for pizza if you don't want to buy an expensive one but I picked up four because my Dollar Trees were out of pizza pants they had all the other ones but pizza so I had to go to a different store and I just picked up four um, my Amazon package came in today I'm super excited I can't wait to start working on my DIY I need one of these for that I'm not gonna do a video but I'll show you guys a picture of it once it's all done because I've never done it before so I don't know how it's gonna work um, if it turns out really good, then I can always just film another one since I have extra pans. And then I got one more package of the 4th of July plates to use during the month of July um, for the kiddos breakfast and their lunch because you only get 12. So I did pick up one more. And they finally stocked back up on these. I got three of them and I already opened one because I needed um, a hook for the kitchen. So I got three, four packs of these kind. And I haven't had any issues with these damaging my walls or not working as good as a command strip, just in case you guys wanna know. Um, for me, I use them out here and this is metal and I use them on my wood walls. I use them everywhere pretty much and I've never had an issue. So I did get three of those, but like I said, I opened one and then I got two. So those hold up to one pound. These hold up to two pounds. Um, Cause sometimes I make wreaths and heavier things with the pizza pans and it won't fit on one of these and it won't hold it. So I got the bigger size. So stocked up on those, was excited to get more of those. If you saw my thumbnail, I found the bag with the bees on it, and it says, Save the Bees, Protect the Hive. I love the pink color, and I love the font, and then the side looks like a bumblebee. So, I did get the bag, um, and I used it that day. I'm not huge on the bee stuff, but I did I did want the bag, because I, I love reusable bags, and I thought this was a really nice one. So I did get that. Oh, I meant to use it for stuff. I also picked up four more of these because I don't always see these ones. 
and this is what I use to paint to look like the stackable books instead of doing my old I still do my little tiny ones with the Jenga blocks because those fit in my little tray on my coffee table but I like putting this one over by my island um, and I do one side for one holiday and one side for the other so since I just started doing that I'm gonna need to do Halloween um, fall Christmas and Valentine's Day and then I think I'm good because I have Easter st. Patrick's Day and 4th of July so I just picked up four more just because like I said I don't always see these and I think they're really fun to do so got those I also got two more of the white nautical rope. I love using these for hangers for signs and this rope is so much softer and I think it's prettier than the regular nautical rope. So I got two more just to keep in my crafting stuff because I do use them a lot. Um, I found these succulent clips but I'm most likely going to take these and just use them in my little animal planters because I have a few that I really don't like um, so I'm not gonna necessarily need the clip for it but I really liked the color of the succulent so I got two of those and I went ahead I'm always picking up flowers when I see different colors and new ones um, I picked up two of these Gerber daisies and they're pink with a little bit of orange in the middle and then I picked up two in the white just because I don't have these and like I said I'm always doing DIYs and making stuff for people so they're not necessarily for me I mean I can always use them for me but like I said I just love picking up different florals because you never know when you're gonna come across a DIY and then you have to go out and find the florals and it's the wrong time so I just love having different varieties to choose from um, I picked up another one of these ready wipes. You get 50 in here. I also picked up a two pack of the hand sanitizer, antibacterial in the lemon scent. You get two bottles. So I did pick up those because whenever I do giveaways, friend mail, um, anything like that, I like to gift a little thing of wipes and hand sanitizer. And she's gonna know who she is but I went ahead and just picked up another one of this she said she was on the hunt for it so I need to email you or you email me and I got this for you and it's the rose hip and evening primrose one ounce facial serum so I got that for you you know who you are you need to email me hun so I can send this out to you uh, something boring real quick. I got this garage brush soft grip um, by scrub buddies for my shower. I Need to clean my shower. I'm probably gonna bring you guys along with me and do like a clean with me video. I might do that Wednesday while Shannon is at speech therapy. I haven't used my foaming stuff yet and I'm gonna use that so a lot of you have been asking I, I mean to do clean with me videos, but half the time I forget and when I'm right in the middle of cleaning something is when I remember and then I'm like, well, I already started. So I just, I forget honestly, but I bought a new brush so I can clean my bathroom. Leland wanted a dirt bike. He already has a green one, but it's a lot smaller than this one. Um, so I showed him all the colors and he wanted blue. So he got that. Shannon got this, like one of those stress relievers, slow rising. This one's a lot sturdier though, and it's just a rainbow. So she got that. Um, I have the Fox, if you guys remember. Well, they had new ones and they had a sloth, but I picked up this one that is a hedgehog or a porcupine or a raccoon I have no idea what he is I'm guessing he is a hedgehog 
but he's so cute and I figured he could sit outside with my little fox and keep him company. So I went ahead and picked that up. The sun will hit this and it'll make his lights or his eyes turn on. So you do have to turn it on though. There's a button right here. You could put these in your window. Um, I actually might bring my fox back in and see if it'll work. I don't think it'll work in my little kitchen window, so that's why I have him outside. But I went ahead and got him because he's so cute. And I saw these and I almost went crazy with them, but I only got two for now. We do have some on the back side of our house that turn on at night, so that way when my husband gets home and it's already dark, he can see up the pathway to walk to the back door. But I found sunflowers and they're so pretty. So I got two of them and I will see how I like them and hopefully they'll have more and I can get more. So I just got two for now because I think two of ours are actually broken. I picked up this Crafters Square stencil brush. I like using these for when I do my rugs for holidays. That's a really good brush for that. I picked up a Craft Glue in Clear by Crafters Square. I'm gonna be working on a DIY so I need that. And then I found this um, craft scraper. They've been coming out with a lot of new um, crafter square you, uh, tools and like things that look like it would be for a Cricut. And I actually don't have one of these. So I'm keeping the all white one. And it just says applies material, clean, large areas. I do a lot of DIYs with rub-on transfers and I can use this for that or whatever and then this one I'm probably gonna save it for the next giveaway and it has the purple handle so or I might put this one in there and keep the purple I haven't decided but one of these is for me and one is for the, the next giveaway that I'm gonna do um, I needed to pick up another one of these it's the two-in-one foot file these work really good um, the only thing is if you're doing it too hard, you can snap this handle, and I did that, so I need to replace it. So I got another one. I just got pink. I have really dry, cracked heels, so I'm always using that in the shower. Um, and then I got this manicure set. I remember I got one, and I don't know what I did with it. So if I ever find the other one, I can always gift it to somebody. But I got this one. It's a four-piece. includes nail brush, nail file, cuticle pusher, and a nail clipper. So if I find my other one, I can always save this one or I'll just open this one and if I find the other one, I can use that one for a giveaway or friend mail or whatever, but I really liked that, so I got it. I found this by the, um, by the registers and it includes eight cotton swabs, one tweezer, one mini scissor, two adhesive bandages, one safety pin, and four safety pins. So like they're different safety pins. Um, yeah, the sizes are different. The one safety pin is 3.9 centimeters, and then you get four safety pins that are 1.6 inches, and one multifunctional knife. So I figured I could put this in my glove box or the center console of my car, and it's just a first aid kit. So I love that. I saw it and I was like, oh, I should really get that and put it in my car because I still don't have like a first aid kit for my car. So I got that and I love that it comes in a little case. It's super tiny and I mean, I can always put more bandages in there if I need to. Um, I got these for a friend. I'm gonna include them in her friend mail. You get three um, adult face masks and they are in the girl camo. So it's like pink, black and white camo and there's three in here. I don't like these kinds of masks that are like the doctor masks. I hate these kind. So, but when I saw them, I went ahead and got them for somebody else. So those are going into some friend mail. And this one I might keep for myself or I might be giving it to somebody else for um, friend mail. Cotton face covering includes three filters, reusable, washable, breathable, adjustable. And it's in the cheetah print, but it shows you back here. It comes with three filters. So that might be for somebody as well. My husband had a Zoom class on Saturday. And 
um, we realized we don't have any headphones. So he had to use Shannon's little dinosaur ones and um, she bent the where you plug it in. So it was really hard for him to hear. I thought we had headphones. I, I only have ones for my iPhone and they don't have the same end. So I just picked him up these plain black ones because he's gonna have another Zoom class. It's for work um, on this coming Saturday. So I got him a pair of just plain black ones um, so we'll see if these work. So I got him those and then I went ahead and got me some for if I'm ever on my laptop doing something because all I have are my AirPods or, um, my iPhone headphones. So I picked up a pair of pink for myself just in case if I'm ever on my laptop and I need a pair of headphones for something. So got a two pack of the white baskets that are bigger um, in case I need some for organizing my craft armoire in case I come across something and I need one of these and I use these in my pantry I use them in my kitchen drawers so I just went ahead and got another two pack I found these cute little tiny picture frames um, it holds a 2.5 by 3.5 picture so really tiny these would be cute for three tiered trays or wherever but I got two in the white and it comes with a burlap bow at the top and it looks like wood and it has a kickstand so I got two white and two black um I got some more hair ties or hair clips for my sister the one that's expecting a baby I found these so I have a feeling her baby is gonna have a lot of hair um this could just be my Mexican intuition but or the mexican wise tales they always say when you have heartburn your baby is going to have a lot of hair i never experienced heartburn with either of my kids and they came out bald so that's probably why um my sister had a lot of hair and she's with a hispanic guy and he had a lot of hair so i'm i'm hoping she'll be able to use these because i wasn't able to use these kinds with shannon i had to use just like the head wraps because she had no hair so I couldn't clip anything to her hair. But I got her two of these. Long story short, these are gonna go in that bag. And my sister that loves pineapples, I found this. I figured she could put this in her purse. She loves pineapples. It comes with a cute little case. That's for her. I'll just give it to her the next time I see her. I got these scrunchies for 4th of July. I'm probably gonna use this one in Shannon's hair. It looks like the American flag and then you get a solid dark blue. I always put her hair up in a ponytail, so um, I'll probably use that one for the 4th of July. I found some new makeup that I was excited about. You guys know I love liquid eyeshadow. That's actually what I'm wearing right now. I order it all the time from Shop Miss A, and I got one in my Ipsy bag that I loved, but it's expensive and I don't want to pay that much for it. So I saw this one. It's Mega Last Liquid cat suit shimmer liquid eyeshadow in cashmere love and it has the little plastic handle thingy where they're hanging him and I almost missed it this one was down on the bottom and I was trying to figure out where the rest were so I could see if they had more colors and I found them they were in between some other makeup and then I found this one that's also liquid eyeshadow but it's putty in my hands and it's kind of like a nude brown matte color and I love this one this one reminds me of the one I have in my ipsy bag that's all gone so I got those two I'll let you know how those are and then I got this wet and wild natural blend lip shimmer in sugar and I'm thinking it's in this color this is gonna be for me unless I don't like it smells good doesn't show a color so anyways I got that for myself too I finally found something that was on my wish list so the sunflower solar lights were on my wish list the little raccoon hedgehog whatever uh, you want to call it was on my wish list 
and so was this coffee cup and it says let your dreams blossom and it has a little blue truck with flowers it says it on both sides I haven't been able to find anything else I know they came out with stove top stove top cover like burner covers with this and the placemats the towels the oven mitt the pot holders I haven't been able to find anything but I found this so I'm hoping that that same store will have it um, where I found this coffee cup but it is microwave safe dishwasher safe and I don't know how many ounces it is but it's a decent sized coffee cup and I love it so I got that these were on my wish list as well the lady was putting them out and I was impatiently waiting for her to like finish what she was putting there so I could go over and grab some yeah I was that girl that day um, this one says fresh flower market I'm probably gonna try and find a DIY I can do with this or maybe I will put this in the middle of a wreath because I have one on my door right now and it just says spring and I really don't like it because I don't have anything else in my house right now that says spring. Everything says welcome or has sunflowers. So maybe I'll take the spring off and put this there. It's on my door right here. I can see it. So found that one. And then this one says weed it and reap. And I love both of these. So I got those. And this one was on my wish list. I'm probably going to take it off of here and find something to do probably in my kitchen and it says locally grown fresh produce and it has it is crooked this needed to be more this way on the steak I'm so OCD <laughs> and I found this one that says farmers market I wasn't fond about this stuff like hanging like that so I'm gonna take this apart and do a DIY with this as well so I'll probably take this off and then I can include these around it or something. I, I don't know yet, but this was on my wish list too. Got those. I'm sure she put out more, but uh, she ended up getting called over to the register and I wasn't going to sit there and wait for her to come back. And I mean, they know me there. I'm sure she would have let me go through the boxes, but the kids were getting impatient. They didn't want to be in there anymore because we were just standing around waiting for her. So I'll probably go back and see what else they have. Um, I got these flip-flops. Now I have a ton, but they're not the best quality. Like I say, these are perfect just for like lounging around in the house when you get out of the shower. You know, I'm, if I'm going to do anything outside or whatever, then I don't have to wear my really nice ones. I can just wear these. But it says be, leave in yourself, and it has the bees. So I got a pair of those. I'm a medium. But these look like large, so I don't know if these are going to be too big on me. But if they are, I can always include this in the giveaway. I'll just try it on. I'll clean my feet. I'll try them on, see if they fit. And if not, then we don't have to worry about it. Found these socks, and then I saw Jay over at Frugal Jay Hollum, and I was like, girl, we think alike. Now, I don't normally like really long socks, but like she said, these are really stretchy. And I can always just you know scrunch them down I don't have to wear them all the way up my leg but I loved the gray and of course it has donuts so I did get those they did have the bright neon orange or neon green that were limes but I didn't I didn't get those and I got the black with the avocados because like I say I have to wear darker socks because of my hardwood floors it would just ruin those green ones but I got these two and these are men's 6 to 12 in the brand juncture those were on my wish list too I went ahead and got my husband a birthday card his birthday is May 3rd um, still don't know what we're doing yet but I always get him a card this one's from me I'll let Shannon pick out one for her dad um, but it just I thought it was really pretty it has a lot in here I'm not gonna read it but this will be perfect for him like I said I still don't know what I'm gonna get him or if we're gonna go to dinner or do something whatever he wants to do I haven't asked him yet I found these thank you cards that are really pretty you only get six but I loved the florals on there and I needed these a few days ago but it's okay 
um, now I have some and it says that they're blank inside so that way I can write a note inside you know for people that have been sending me friend mail so I stocked up on those I have a ton and I don't know what I did with them when I reorganized my closet can't find them now when my closet's a mess I know where everything is when I organize it and clean it I don't know where anything is isn't that funny how that works I got these for Elaine I'm still trying to work up your package all those lol stickers were stolen it was in that box so I was able to get these I haven't been able to find the 3d ones yet I'm hoping they'll bring them back but I don't know if they will um, but you get puffy glitter foil and glossy so anything lol is for her you guys know that and I found these and of course I fell in love with the watermelon but there's a cute little coffee cup there's an avocado there's um, the pineapple the donut it's just a bunch of food and only a few of them have googly eyes that stick out like the pizza the hamburger the french fries the waffle the taco and the donut all the rest just have regular eyes but I loved that and you get 25 in there for friend mail I got this frame now I really I do like what it says it's pretty simple and I love the flowers but I got it for the length of the frame I'm hoping it'll fit one of my diamond paintings but I don't think so now that I'm looking at it I think it's gonna be too small um, and if not I can always save it and keep it how it is or I mean it could always go right over there um, but I love the different flowers and then it just says be humble and I love the font so I got that I kind of went list pad crazy because I haven't found any good list pads lately now these I didn't realize until right now that they don't have a magnet on the back but that's okay um, sometimes I need one like I said to put right here um, so this one says squeeze the day and it has lemons on it it's by crown jewels these were hanging on a clip strip <clears throat> down in the aisle where all like the glassware is like the coffee cups the glass plates that's where I found this it was on a clip strip hanging every store is different but just in case if you look for this in the stationery and you can't find it look in the coffee cup aisle where all the glass plates are and stuff sometimes they have them on clip strips it doesn't say how many you get but I'm assuming you get 60 or 50 so I don't know if I'm gonna keep this one for myself that might go in friend mail or giveaway this one I am keeping for myself because I love it has the little boxes to check it off and this one says shopping list busy bee shopping list and it has the honey with the bees I wasn't necessarily fond of like the bee I'm not huge on it it is cute I was mainly I like it because of the little boxes I got one for me and one for somebody else I'm sure she knows who she is and those, like I said, don't have magnets, but you can always take one off of another one, um, like your old one, like before you throw it away, save the magnet and just re-glue it to another one that doesn't have one. Then I found this one that does have a magnet on it and it says, when life gives you lemons, make lemonade. And it's by Jot. This, these, now these ones were in the stationary aisle and it does have a magnet. So I'll either keep this one or keep this one for myself. I'm not sure. And then this one is gonna be for friend mail. It says home sweet home. And I just love the really pretty flowers. I love the font. And then this one says take your time and it's spelt like the seasoning of time because it has a mason jar with some so it's t-h-y-m-e also 60 sheets I thought that was really pretty I like the mason jar of course so got those and I think that's it for this Dollar Tree haul yes so I was really excited to find those list pads the farmer market um, decor pieces the coffee cup the sunflower solar lights and all the socks and the flip-flops and the bag. I was really excited, so. 
wasn't a very big haul, but I found a lot of new stuff and a lot of wishlist items. So that's it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, give it a big thumbs up. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe. I would love to be part of my YouTube family if you're not already. And until then, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.